Salam and hello, my dear students. This is the seventh slot of our self care know yourself series, and in this slot we are going to examine the social comparison theory. Okay, here we go. Let's take a look at this diagram here and say we put ourselves in the middle tier so that we can conduct examination of upward comparison with those in the upper tier and so a downward comparison with those in the lower level. Right, let's start with the downward comparison, which the point of departure is really from a sense of gratitude. So why do we say that? Oh, take for example, we are to visit a friend who is very ill. Then we start to uh, be appreciative of the good health that we have. Similarly, when we look at someone who is struggling financially, someone who has to work very, very hard to make ends meet, and we start to appreciate the fact that we could live comfortably on a day-to-day -day basis, even though we are not very, very well off. So when we look at others who are being tried and tested in various ways, in ways, in situations which if we were being subjected to, we may not be able to come out of it as well and as strong as they do. Okay, And that's why it drives on the sense of gratitude, which brings us to the sense of security in the society. Well, now let's take a look at the upward comparison. When we are comparing ourselves to those who are um, so-called better than us, what we are really doing is that we come from a point of admiration. Right? We look at them, they could be better, better than us in terms of um, academic performance, they could be better than us in terms of social standing, they could be better, better than us in terms of the people skill, for example, and we start to think, what can we do to be like them? So that admiration will actually drive us to emulate them okay and we start to see what are the positive traits and their strategy approaches that we could actually adopt and adapt into our own pursuit for happiness and success and that is what upwards comparison is all about uh, in the in the setup of a society so my dear students the long and short of it is that um, it doesn't matter uh, where we are at this point of life the important thing is that we do not linger uh, in the sense of um, deflation, meaning that we give up trying at all, uh, that's uh, looking downwards and not learning anything from that. And neither do we want to be considered that is looking upwards and then thinking that, oh, we are already there, we need not do anything anymore, and we stop trying. So in life, it always has to be, we always have to be on the move so that we are always in pursuit of something that is better, so the version of us that is better than what we are now, and that is success in the best of its definition. Okay? Right. Um, thank you very much uh, for following through these seven slots in this um, Know Yourself self-care series. So we're coming to the end of it now, really. Thank you so, so much uh, for watching. I do hope that uh, it has been a beneficial um, series for you, no matter how small the impact may be. So stay safe, stay focused, stay on track, and uh, all the best. See you around. Bye.